Hi, so today I'm going to show you guys how to wax pot a pickup. I'm actually going to be doing that on this guitar. It's a 1987 Charvel. Uh, the pickup itself is a bit microphonic. So I have some delay on the amp right now. If I turn this up and shout through it, hello! hello. 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 You can actually hear my voice. We don't want that on stage because at high volumes, then everything starts feeding back. So wax potting is the way to kind of take care of that. And I'm going to show you how. So now that I've removed the pickup, I'm ready to start the wax potting itself. Here's what I'm using. I'm using basic household paraffin wax. Some people like to use different kinds to get certain tones. I'm not really going to be that picky right now, so this is just a basic golf wax that I got at the store. Uh, the other three things that I need to do is, here's a pot. The water goes in here. You're going to use a double boiler. You don't just want to put the wax down in here directly. The wax is going to go in here to melt. I'm lifting up the glass by putting the spoon in upside down. So when I put the glass there doesn't actually touch the bottom, just the water, and the wax will melt in there. So now we've got our wax starting to melt inside the double boiler. Got kind of a little bit of a wimpy boil going on in the back there with the water underneath. You certainly don't want a raging boil because uh, that's not, you don't really don't need that much to melt wax. I'm using, these come in like little, looks like bars of soap. I'm using one of the bars. That should be enough. It's just, you need enough wax to cover the, submerge the pickup entirely, and it really won't take that much, so that should be about enough. So now the wax is completely melted. You can't even really see it, obviously because they're both clear liquids. I've actually turned the stove off, and we got plenty of heat in there with the water to keep the thing melted. I'm going to just insert the pickup in here gently. Make sure it's submerged. It is. Perfect. Perfect. And I'm going to put about 10 minutes on the kitchen timer here. That should be enough for the wax to penetrate all the little air pockets around the copper of the pickup. You might probably notice air bubbles coming out. That's natural because that's how it kind of works out in between everything there. And let's come back in 10 minutes. Okay, so 10 minutes are up now, and I'm going to take this, just move it around a little bit to make sure no more air bubbles come out. I'm not seeing anything else happening, so that's a good sign. So now let's gently lift it up, and let the rest of the wax kind of drip out of there a little bit. Move it over to just a paper towel. Put dry on the outside. All right, now let that sit there for a couple hours. Just walk away. It obviously was in a boiling situation for 10 minutes, so metal and everything's still going to be pretty hot. It's going to take a little time for that wax to kind of cool down and do what it's supposed to do. So come back in a couple hours. So I reinstalled the pickup, and I have the amp set pretty loud, got some delay on it, so I'm going to shout through it now, see if we can get the same effect as we did in the beginning of the video. Assuming everything went well, we should not hear my voice echo at all. Woo! And we heard nothing, so it's pretty loud, that would have, you would have heard it, so that's wax potting. <laughs>